We didn't still want to speak to concerning the get rich formula that was taught to Neville Gallen by Abdullah. And this formula is available to everyone who's having this human experience. Because you see, that formula is within you. However, there are many people looking for the formula in all of the wrong places. So there are many different religions. And those religions represent the places that people are looking for the formula. But this formula of which I speak is your own awareness of being, your consciousness. So the only one that is stopping you or blocking you from using this formula to achieve your every desire is you. And why they who would have set up this kind of system to cause you to drift away from who you are, the reason why they were able to be so successful is because from a very young age, they make sure to impress your subconscious mind with lies about yourself. And so, you were never taught to seek to know who you are. You were never taught to look within yourself to find the answers of life. You were taught to look on the outside. And so, we see Abdullah was bringing the formula to Neville Gadot to teach us that we were brainwashed to look to a God, our Savior, outside of ourselves. Because the formula represents the Savior. And your Savior is your desire. So if you have desire for water because you're thirsty, then water is your savior. Okay, if you have a strong desire for food because you are hungry, then food is your savior. But they give you an idol and a false savior to be your master, to rule over you. And they set up that idol over 2,000 years ago. And that is why most people who believe that there was a man 2,000 years ago who was born to save the entire world. Most of the time, those are the people who are giving their power away and thinking that they are special. Thinking that God is a God of mediocrity and that God is a God that embraces poverty. They think that God is a God of mediocrity. But common sense will teach you that if you look around at nature, nature always brings forth bountifully. That is why when it comes to the get rich formula, if you look at my thumbnail, you see it represented by a tree that is packed with fruit and is bringing forth its fruit because the fruit that it is bringing forth represents the life that is in the tree. And whatever life that is in you, that is what you would bring forth. That is why the formula is in you because God and man are one. God and man is man's awareness of being, man's imagination. That is why the formula that Abdullah gave Neville is to use his imagination, sleep in his imagination night after night as if he's sleeping in his mother's home in Barbados while Neville was actually living in New York. So my brother, my, my, my sisters, you can bend reality when you understand that the formula is within you. You can bend reality when you realize that you are the creator, when you realize that you are the savior, you are the lord and master, because you are the lord and master of your own destiny. For it is your own thoughts that's creating your reality and creating your personality. Therefore, if money is a material substance that you can handle tangibly, and it will give you a psychological experience whereby it will make you feel good, it will make you feel happy, it will make you feel fulfilled, it will make you believe that you're taking care of yourself properly and all of that. Okay, then it is producing virtue unto you. It is giving value. Therefore, you're told that whatsoever things are good and whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are pure, whatsoever things are true, that you must think on these things because when you think on these things, this is how you will develop the desire to have these things in your life because you want to live your life 
the best way that you can. So, my brother and my sisters, the formula for a better living lies within you. And Abdullah was teaching Neville so that we would take this teaching and understand why our ancestors have always been saying, man, know thyself. Because if you know yourself, then you will understand that you're one with nature. That is why I have to use the tree with the fruit because nature is speaking to us all the time. And so the truth is right before us and we are looking away onto idols. And so all those people are looking on the outside and believing in a man 2,000 years ago and believing in the Jesus and Mary story as literal and secular history when it is not. When you understand that the Bible just is the human mind and must be interpreted psychologically, then you will understand the Bible is a book of mind, science, and it holds all of the formulas for life. In other words, the are natural laws that governs this whole universe. And if you look around, you can see that every seed, every species always reproduces after its own kind. No one can change that. And whatsoever you sow psychologically, that is what you would reap in your everyday life. So my brother, my sisters, get on the get rich vibration and frequency by understanding that you have the formula to get rich inwardly. You get the formula, you have the formula for abundance inwardly. Therefore, what is blocking you from getting that abundance in your life is the image that you've been given to keep you in a perpetual state of mental slavery. So break mental slavery and live your life whichever way you want it to be. Because it's only you can emancipate yourself from mental slavery. Do not let your eye that was given to you to see be blinded. And when I'm, speak of, when I'm speaking of the eye, I'm not speaking of the outer eye. I'm speaking of the inner eye, the inner eye of intelligence that will help you to be more clairvoyant, that will help to get you more intuitive, more imaginative, more creative, that will take you into the, the place of the sixth sense and take you out of the, the wall of the five senses. That is why we meditate. That is why we visualize. That is why we do scripting. That's why we do affirmations. That's why we do all the things that we do. So we wouldn't be trapped in this three-dimensional world just living by the five senses and living at the level of the animal. So my brother, my sister, many people have been kept by the level of the animal. But Abdullah came with a message to set humanity free. Because Abdullah didn't just cross the line where race is concerned. He went beyond. That is why if you travel to any part of the world, people are the same. You have the wise and you have the foolish, the rich and the poor. They, they are everywhere. It doesn't matter what you raise or you create. So people, it's time to wake up and find the richness that is within you by knowing that you are the formula. You are the placebo. It's all about you, my brother and my sisters. So it's time to wake up and understand the teaching of our mystical ancestors of which they have been teaching all down through the ages. And many people miss them. They miss their saviors. Because they're looking for a man in flesh. When it is actually a state of mind. Get that state of mind and cultivate that state of mind of Abdullah. If you're a melanated person. That is the only hope. You would be doing the things of your ancestors. Instead of calling on your ancestors, be like your ancestors. Because that DNA is within you. For Abdul Amin, a true servant of the invisible. A man who could tap into his invisible self. A man who knows how to use his melanin. And I can go on and on and on. But we'll come to a close here. And I want to thank you very much for listening to me. I want to say to you, if this is the very first time that you listen to me, I want to say if it makes sense to you, if it really resonates with you and you haven't subscribed already, I'll definitely encourage you to subscribe, to like, to comment, and to share this video. Also, if you want to grab a hold of my work, I'll definitely encourage you to get my latest book. It's called The Secret Vagina. 
the mystery of the virgin birth. And if you really understand that immaculate conception of which I wrote in that book, you would realize that you can create your life whichever way you want it to be. You would realize that the immaculate conception can take place psychologically and spiritually and also physically. And those who experience it from the spiritual side, they are the one who comes to tell you that your economy is inwardly. Tap into your inner economy and you'll be able to manage this outer economy of Caesar. So get that book plus my other books. All of the links are down below. Also, remember, free thinkers and seekers, university, that's my university, I'll start billing. I'll be posting money for people who have become members. Also, on my Patreon, you can become a member also. And I have a course there that's called the Inner Sun Science and Technology to Create Your Reality Consciousness. And along with that is a bonus course and self-concept. But plus, much more that I have in store for you. For those of you who want to know more about the Abdullah, and what this whole teaching is really all about and to get into the Abdullah formula to attract abundance in your life and putting something in place for you. So stay tuned and keep your ears open. Okay. So as I come to a close here, I just want to encourage everyone to check out all of the links that are down below and let your intuition lead you and guide you into what to do. So with that being said, my brother and my sister, I just want to say peace, love you all, I'm out.